Hello, my son. Can you tell us a little bit about who you are and what your profession is? I'm fine, thank you. Um, I work and cook in Sweden and I'm responsible for the supply and the assortment for all the meat for co whole, whole cook for the whole country. Right. So can you tell us a little bit about why you started with Naturbetesköt? I think that was in 2019 we got it out on the market. Yes, it was. Uh, well, we, we, we want to have more, more meat in the supermarket with, from meat who has been out on grassing and also um, to, to, um, to have meat who has been out on this uh, landscape to get them more uh, open. So today, many animals in Sweden maybe are not out in the summer times, but we know that this kind of, of, uh, of carcass always have to go out and we get a better landscape and also a better fauna and uh, it's good for very many things. Mm. So that was the beginning of this project. <laughs> yes. So Natur, but the shot is, is a good type of meat. Is it also good for coop? Is it working as a product in the market? Yes, it is. Uh, we we buy it as we take the full uh, responsibility for the anatomy, and when you do that kind of business, you need to grow uh, slowly because you need to sell the all carcass of the of the of the of the kind of all pieces of the carcass, and uh, you can always look after in the summertime. Maybe you can get a better price for, for example, antrecot and a little bit less for the for the, some kind of uh, cooking meat uh, and then you can change it in the winter time so you always need to be in this uh, well change the price after what kind of pieces the customer buy mm. so uh, what do you see as a challenge for Naturbetesköt and Coop as in the future it, it's always this anatomy I think you <laughs> always need to have focus on it so you don't mess have too much of something and too less of something else. You need to put a price on the correct uh, correct price on the correct pieces the customer want to have. Hmm. And um, would you have any advice for any Latvian supermarket who, who could be interested in, in making something similar from Latvian beef? Mm, I think we when we start up this project we, we decided to have a special weight of the carcass and we also say that we want to have a special um, quality by the Europe classifications and we also say that there should be some special kind of fat group so we don't have want to have it too length or too fat we want and we want to have a similar kind of quality every time the customer buy it and it has been quite not a premium exactly but a little bit more uh, similar all the time mm. and that I think is uh, was a good thing we took and, and do you have any customer reactions to Naturbetesköt to, to, to share with us? Uh, always good. We, we have, on these three years, we, have, we haven't had any customer who has uh, phoned us or sent email to us to say that something was wrong. It's all, always good things they have to say, tell us about it. That is a good taste of it, that's a, uh, tender, that it's, uh, well, they like it. Very yes, good. Yes. Well, so thank you very much for talking to us about Natubeteshut, my son.